Well, good morning. Um, this morning is the start of the International 5K. As you can see, I have my raining gear on because it's been raining. Um, it's, we're have been, have been on a holding pattern um, just because of the these heavy cells I've been going in. So I'll probably be late for this International 5K. I'm not even sure if I could actually run in it, but um, we just didn't want to take any chances and and um, be, play it safe because I. The marathon is the most important thing that I'm coming here for. So um, we're just gonna wait for the train to come and then get to the event and see if I could still run it. And we'll see how it goes. I don't know if I can still wear this on, but um, we'll just have fun either way. Okay, so God has been good to us. The rain has just let up. Uh, we just got here, and as you can see, I'm not, I'm not late. So I'm happy about that. I'm not late. I can just make it in on time and. And I'm um, gonna just find where I need to go and then uh, just line up and have fun. This is gonna be a fun run. Take our time. Mom, just take your time getting getting back to the park. Okay? Alright. Okay, so right now um, I'm gonna try to get into, what, into this crowd here. I mean, they had all these crowds already set, signed, uh, set up, so I don't, I don't care because this is gonna be the party crowd right in the back here. So I'm just gonna be right there having fun and just, 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 just kicking, this, kicking this big party off. For Sunday, because Sunday is the main event. So, so we're gonna have, we're just gonna have a blast here. Start off this 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 weekend with this 5K, then just do all the activities and then go for it. Okay, I gotta go. Gotta go. Okay, we, the race just officially kicked off, and I'm just gonna wait until this crowd could, gets cleared up, and then I can start my run. So we're gonna have it fun. Now we're moving. Now we want to stop. <laughs> 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 Here we go, we're in the start. Here we go, we're starting right now. This is awesome. Just taking it casual, taking it easy, seeing it, taking this really fun sightseeing tour around downtown Chicago. <laughs> So, just taking a walk break right now, just looking around. These are all the, all the people, a lot of them are going to run the, I think, the uh, Chicago Marathon. I'm just taking my time, just going through, just keeping my legs relaxed, and just seeing all the sights, really, it's really cool. We have overpass for the CTA, super cool. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, I'm enjoying it. Just passing by the famous Chicago Theater. Awesome, it really is lit up, it's awesome. <laughs> One of the highlights of visiting Chicago is to see this. You gotta see this, hold on, gotta take a picture. This is the coolest thing to go down the downtown main street. Real, real good tour. Loving it, enjoying it, just taking it all in. You know, everyone was right, this is a very cool thing to do. It's a 5K for fun. Just enjoy it. It's humid outside. A lot of you. Well, I'm taking it easy. All right. Catch you later, guys. Okay, as you can see, um, I'm still on the course. Finished mile one. 11:24 pace, a little bit fast, but I wasn't even trying to go fast. It just felt, I guess, because this is a the flat course, I just felt like I was going easy. So I got to just keep in mind, even ease it up even more for for the uh, Chicago Marathon, so just keep it easy, and I'll be good to go for 26.2 miles. All right, let's have more fun. Yeah, this is a lot of tall, tall buildings here. A lot of people in the back here, just enjoying and having a fun 5K. It's still humid out here. I'll take my walk break right now, and just enjoy it. But I feel like I'm going like race pace. For some reason, I must be the, the black horse. I'm gonna really just gear it down. I'm gonna gear it down. All right, let's continue my view. Now that's this here's tower, or I forgot what it's named now, but it's really tall. You can't even see it through this, the clouds. Wow. Okay, so I just finished mile two, um, around 10.40 something pace. 
I don't even think that's really 10 miles. I think this GPS is really messing up. But not, I planned on that anyways, but now I'm just encountering the first water stop. That's weird. I thought it'd be like 1.5 miles, but it's kind of humid. So I'm gonna done take a water break right now because I'm thirsty, so. I'm gonna take one right now. Okay, I'm right now made it downtown. I think near the finish, but there's up people going the opposite way, heading towards the finish. There are, this looks like a double back. That's what you call it. Really cool. All flat. Yes, all flat. So, having fun. It's humid out of here. But still, take my time. Get my legs warmed up for the marathon. Very fun. There's Ashley right there. There's Ashley right there. Now, an opportunity to see myself on a big screen. Where am I? I can see myself right I love, 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 love the entertainment. finish line making it to the start and actually see my gate I have to enter into Harrison gate number seven so getting a good idea of where I need to go for tomorrow's Mar uh, Chicago Marathon Make it there mile three baby only 0.1 miles to go we got this we finished yay finished did awesome it was so much fun just going down and to see you know, preview of the Chicago Marathon course. I would recommend anyone doing this. Here's the medal. Super cool. I love this one. Nice size medal. Nice size. Definitely worth recommending. So on top of getting a, a medal, we also get snacks in a bag. Very convenient. I think more racers should be doing that. Putting their snacks in a bag so they have something to get. Oh, I gotta get more snacks. Right there. Okay guys, this is really important because I found my gate that I have to to go to um, for the Chicago Marathon, so I'm not lost. Now I found it, so I have an idea of where I need to be, and my mom hopefully will meet me, and I don't think she can go through it, but at least we both know how to get here at gate seven. This is why, gate seven for Corral L, that's my corral. So right now we are back in Chinatown, this time in Chinatown Square. We wanna get some hot food. Uh, right after the pocket, we're hungry, so we're gonna go here, because we see that there's some cheap eats, and we're gonna check it out. Right now, I'm in the middle of Chinatown Square. Square. It's a huge, huge complex with lots of stores. A lot of them are not open yet, but we're gonna go to the one that's like right there, which is um, China, China, what, Great Wall of China? Is that what it's called? Yes. Great, Great, Wall of, of China. Great Wall of China restaurant to get some food to take out. Okay, so this is why I came here. If you can see like for here, all these roast chicken, roast duck, um, roast, just barbecue ribs. This is so good. I'm going to eat up, fuel up with this for the Chicago Marathon. I think this will be my key. Let's do this. Okay, so right now I'm at the St. Anna Bakery. That's in the Chinatown Square. Look at all these goodies. Look at all this. this we're getting that, we're getting that, that, that. And look at the prices. I mean, you can't beat these prices. All of this. All this is that. That's what we're getting. All of that. Yum, 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 yum. All to fuel for the Chicago Marathon. So we just had a really good tour of this place, and we're definitely going to come back maybe right after the Chicago Marathon. This is just a lot of stuff to see here and to get and to eat. So, and the prices are good. The prices are really good. So we're just going to we're we're probably going to come back definitely after the Chicago Marathon to eat here so to celebrate. Uh, my finish so let's do this